Bonjour, mon ami. Welcome to our channel. And today we will speak about fragrances for fall. Perfect fragrances for fall. And we will have sample set from these fragrances. Yes, soon. Soon, today. No, we already have because this video will be postponed. Will be... Yeah. <laughs> so, so, so yeah. probably it's already sold out. <laughs> Sorry, guys. <laughs> But I will, I will put link uh, in the description. If it's so sold out, there will be a red button. Notify me when it will be available. Hit the button. So just go to the link and check yeah. if it's available or not. <laughs> <laughs> okay, yeah. let's start with the first fragrance. Well, let's start with definition. What is a fall fragrance? It's warm fragrances. Yeah, it's something like... When spicy, maybe. It, yeah, it's more spicy, more vanilla, more warm and woody since when the fall comes, evening become more colder, daytime sometimes even colder as well. Uh, and um, yeah, and you, you just want to feel cozy. enveloped, cozy, like warm hugs every day, stay at home. Yes. Or maybe not stay at home, depends on you. And um, yeah, that's what is about these fragrances. Let's start with the most light one mm -hmm. in the collection. Which one is more light? I think this one. Bouquet de Dior. Yeah. yeah. Bouquet de Dior from Xerjov. It's also, also, you can think it's Kazamarati, but Kazamarati Xerjov doesn't matter. One company. So where is where? Why one? Okay. You know, we had a meeting with the Xerjov company and they insisted that it is much better smell it not on the blotter but from smell bottle. yeah but smell it from the butter uh, butter <laughs> from from the bottle let me see the difference there's no spicy in a yeah maybe here it's more fresh here you can feel a little bit more yeah. concentrate maybe because it's already stay yeah less on the bottle as they explained to us here, if you smell from the bottle, you can smell less alcohol in more um, middle notes. And on the blower, you will smell the first notes, first impression, and you need to wait until the middle notes will be something obvious for you. So, let me read. <laughs> yeah. Cinnamon. Yeah. Nutmeg. Papyrus. Cedar, Cedar wood. Santal. Amiris, uh, Santal Amiris. Amiris, tobacco flowers, labdanum, vanilla, coumarin mask. Mm. So this one is Such a spicy, a... floral, woody fragrance. Um, as, as our friends in Xerjov company explained to us, this one can be one of the best fragrances for the wedding. Mm? You've been there as well. Maybe, <laughs> maybe yeah, maybe. maybe it was too early. She, she was sleepy. And... Um, also, that fragrance can be really cool for ladies. Yeah, this one is more feminine fragrance. For ladies uh, in a fragrance-free community where, where you cannot wear really obvious, really uh, hard scent. That's especially important to Canada, uh, where a lot of people don't like when the smell is too obvious, when the smell is filling the room, they want to feel feel yourself a little bit cozy with the fragrance, but not other people smell mm -hmm. your fragrance. Bouquet Ideal is a perfect fragrance for that one. Okay. Can you say that it's such a ruby red? Mm -hmm. Yeah? Is yeah. it ruby well, red? For me, it's intense. You know what you say about um, for community yeah. free. Uh, I don't think so, because it's spicy, sweet. But it's spicy, but it's not like spicy, spicy, like everyone will feel. It's like sweetness, sweetness again is... From where is it? This sweetness come? It's there is no vanilla. I think. Only vanilla, and that's all. But it's sweet, not too over sweet. Uh, yeah, it's just a bit, a bit of sweet, a bit of spices, a um, bit of warmness, so a bit of woodiness. I think that's the perfect one for office, for office, for wedding as well. Something yeah, cozy, yeah. confident. Yeah, yeah, that is perfect signature scent for for the fall, lady signature fragrance. Yes, exacto. Let's go to this one, I guess. To no? Ole? Yeah. Let us represent you Ole by Ramon, Ramon Monegal. Yeah. This is sweet. 
more much sweet more sweet than huh? but th this much more sweet and the fruitier and the sweetness here come from like dates yeah dates yeah, yeah, yeah exactly dates and raspberry mm -hmm. but the scent remind me some candies you know like candy style for me it reminds a little bit nail polish <laughs> yeah but nevertheless this this brand always have animalic mask in the structure so you can feel it in any fragrance something like mm. Spanish people, like Spanish people's soul, soul when um, it's pretty fiery. It's and, pretty and attractive. Attractive, sexy. So Ole about that one. It's, it's, it's Spanish temperament. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> about temperament, yeah. Yeah. What do you think it's for ladies? Or unisex? I think that one is unisex. I don't feel... Yeah, it, the sweetness... Moves it a little bit to the feminine side, but not not so much. It's unisex okay. with slightly feminine, um, but um, no. And I think that fragrance is something for not a daytime. It's something for it's evening. Some evening, yes, yeah. Exactly. Evening dates, dance, uh, whatever you want to do uh, in the evening. More sweet, more sweet than the bouquet. Yeah. yeah, sure. So the next one will be. Which one? This one or this one? I think this one. No? Or this one. Let's do the new one in our store. Yeah. BDK, BDK Passe Soir Extra. But it's not only in our store. It's like new fragrance 2023. They just released. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The fragrance was released like, I think, one month ago. But maybe already too. <laughs> because of video. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> so, tell me, what do we have? I think the structure is pretty same, pins, caramel, and uh, spices. But what I can, I, I'm not sure if, if this in the base of the fragrance or not. But on a, on me, in six hours, yeah, about five six hours on my skin, patchouli become really mm. really dominant. This velvety patchouli feeling, even kind of a little bit like leathery feeling. I'm not sure about the pyramid. Vanilla? Let, let me check. Check, check. So, yeah, you are right. Yeah. So we checked the pyramid and yeah, patchouli with something was there and a cashmere on which give me, probably give me this leathery feeling. Ah, I just wanted to ask you about, uh, to compare with Passoir original one, but we will make video yeah. and you will see the difference So and I will explore the difference as well. Mm, because yeah, really <laughs> because different. I, I didn't try them yet. Really so. different. Yeah, we will do full comparison for you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So for now you can say it's like completely two different fragrances. Passoir original and Passoir extra. Mm. Oh, I would I would say, I would say like if you if you have a same grandmother but that's but only be at, only okay. only one thing that you have in common that's that can be the passoir okay. and passoir extent. Okay, they are different. <laughs> <laughs> but what do you think? It's for evening, I guess. Yes. It's like pretty it's more evening. Mm, maybe uh, like um, it can be daytime, but uh, like really cold weather uh, when it's rainy cold because like it's fruity one it's sweet and fruity yeah the spear the skins that's uh what else mm -hmm. the peach uh, yeah so all all of this these fruits give a kind of freshness mm, i would say it's more like opposite to the fall with to the gray fall ah okay it just give the colors to the fall okay so that can be the everyday fragrance during the fall but when it's Really cold. gray, gray and cold day. And um, okay, <coughs> everyday you say occasion, like maybe. I'm not sure about everyday <coughs> occasion because passoir for me smells like uh, this lady who sits in front of you on a date, and she said mm, passoir. <laughs> so like, I yeah, I I, I cannot you. unsee it. Like I cannot unsee it in this fragrance. For me, it is a, it's a pure seduction. It's seduction, but we, when you, you, with this seduction, you just say, like, push harder, work more, push harder. Okay. It's so playful. <laughs> yeah. So, okay. But I cannot unsee it in, in this fragrance, unfortunately. So, uh, for daytime, yeah, there's a certain types of people 
who want to be seductive 24 7. Yes. This is a signature scent for that person. What do you think? It will be popular? Not over popular because Passos War original one, more mass appealing. Okay. And that, and Passos War Extra, since it's extra to perform, it's more concentrated. So it's more for people like who really, scent. yeah, a specific signature scent for sp special type of people who want to be attractive and seductive 24 7, as I said before. Uh, you, th this certain type of people you who just watch them and you just cannot watch in another other people you just admire in this person that's okay so it's not over popular it's uh, will be popular for specific type of people yeah for like fragrance gourmet <laughs> mm. <laughs> let's say it like this let's let's leave it like this okay okay let's do something else we have extreme vanilla by yeah this is nice vanilla Le Fleur de Golf is a brand that uh, created in, um, in France. They produce all the fragrances in Dubai. Mm -hmm. And uh, you can feel the signature of uh, Middle Eastern fragrances yeah. with uh, woody intensity, all the structure of the perfume. All the perfumes are extra du parfum. And absolutely beautiful color, which represents 100% smell of the perfume. The smell of the perfume comes from exotic flowers, with vanilla and slightly woody, but what I can say is tuberose. Spices, maybe? It, it's your replica. Yeah. You should say this word. Yeah, vanilla, for <laughs> sure. It's like, because I say it already. When I say the name, extreme vanilla, yeah. this is everything what we can say about this fragrance, it's extreme vanilla. This is true. Yeah. Because it's different way of vanilla. It's uh, nice. It's a little bit spicy with tuberose. It make like, mix perfect mix of vanilla interesting mix of vanilla yeah. different way of vanilla so yeah the different way of vanilla because it's this vanilla is not feel like over sweet yes it sm smells like more ambery vanilla which is absolutely different something indulging relaxing but at the same time kind of sunset feeling kind of uh sexy feeling because of the spices yeah and also have a woody feeling as well uh in this fragrance Yes, and uh, this vanilla, like, it's sweet, but, like, for me, why I like this fragrance? Because when you have something, like, go together, but completely different feelings, like, you, you, your nose can understand, like, how to feel this fragrance. And I feel, like, vanilla, so intense fragrance, but in the same time, fresh. It's interesting. That's why I like it. Yeah. And? What? About this fragrance? Yeah. Oh, I don't think it's everyday fragrance. It's too in, it's too intense. Yeah, it's also yeah. it's also evening fragrance or a really cold weather fragrance that mm. uh, have a sexy vibe, but sometimes they have a com like comforting vibes, like warm hug vibes. So it's different different way. Maybe yeah, evening more. Mm. Why we don't have this like too much of daytime? Like only one daytime. <laughs> yeah, we have like uh, two autumn or uh, fall for e for evening. Yeah, all fall we should we should go outside. Go in the outside, evening. yeah, because <gasps> soon it will be winter yeah. and it, everything yeah. will be closed. Yes. That's why we have evening. Like th during the day you work. Okay, wear this fragrance, and after go outside a lot of time every day. Outside. Every day, yes. so you have uh, four fragrances all for evening. <laughs> So yeah. four times a week, you should go out in the evening, yeah, exactly. hang out as much as possible. Because Winter is yeah. coming. And uh, yeah. <laughs> we, we have to get a lot of energy for, for winter. <laughs> yep. Uh, and the last one will be... Your favorite one. My favorite one. Yeah, double, double Attack by, by Mind Games. To be honest, I, I would wear this fragrance uh, even... Even, even Even daytime. <laughs> Uh, even. <laughs> For me, it's a little bit heavy. So this is like... Uh, yeah, it's it's a bitter dark chocolate with a bitter orange, with yeah. dried orange. So it's have a kind of artisanal chocolate feeling. Um, it have a... What, what else the, does it have? Agave flower, cinnamon, geranium, pimento oil, pink pepper, and uh, vetiver, sandalwood. Yeah, it's like... But... Uh, it's for sh chocolate lovers, for sure, because I'm not uh, chocolate lovers fragrance. You know, on, on the skin, 
this chocolatey feeling, I cannot catch like the always chocolatey feeling. It's it beginning chocolatey, yes. But then it's moved something to, as I said, something dark magic uh, inside because of this woodsy and a slightly spicy accord from a, from a um, pepper. cinnamon and pepper, yeah. yeah. Slightly spicy, woodsy accord with the mixed with chocolate. It's it's something like dark magic for me. Mm, okay. So I would say like it can be daytime fragrance since it's not projecting extremely much. It's pretty close to your skin. It's not a close, it's a mild one. But mostly mostly yes, it's evening fragrance for again for date for for anything. Mm, to feel yourself okay. comfortable, warm and cozy and relaxed. Yep. So what we will have with this with these five fragrances we will have Discover set. Discover set, which will have each of these five fragrances, 1.5 ml atomizer with a sprayer. So you can yeah. enjoy you can up to five of days of each fragrance on your skin and decide if it works it or not. Or maybe five by five by five, it will be 25 days, so it's almost September will gone, yeah. and it will do something new in uh, in October. Yeah, and you will go outside a lot of time. <laughs> oh yeah, and you will, you will have a fun September, definitely. Yes, exactly. So try them all. Yep. Thank you for watching. Share your thoughts about this fragrance and, and uh, share your favorite fall fragrance. Yeah, I don't think this will be fall. It will be like it's, it will be only September. Okay, September. We will see by November with a new one. Mm, okay. Each month we will do... A new set. <laughs> new set. New set of five for, fragrances. For months, yes. Yeah. <laughs> Monthly okay. set. Okay. Uh, thank you for watching us. And, um, and see you see you soon. Yes, see you soon in the next video.